Well, good morning. I'm first alert meteorologist Brittany Rainey. We have a chilly start to your Thursday. Temperatures are in the 40s, so you're going to want to grab that extra layer. But great days to spend some time outdoors today and tomorrow with temperatures topping out around 70 degrees. We do have that first alert weather day for your Monday as this is going to be our soggy day of the next seven. We're tracking widespread rain showers in the area, and then we are turning much colder next week. That cold air is just going to be plunging south from Canada. So even as we head into Wednesday, this will be the start of that cold air in place. Our average first freeze is November 22nd. We're going to get pretty close across North Texas. Some of our outlying areas likely are going to see those temperatures in the 30s. So here's a look way out November 20th. We're starting off in the morning and temperatures are sitting in the 50s. And then we are looking at those temperatures as we head into November 21st in the morning, a bit chillier. We've got the 40s out to the west around 50 degrees in Dallas in the afternoons. We'll see those highs only around 50s, maybe even low 50s in some spots as we head towards November 22nd. We're waking up to temperatures in the 30s on Friday. And then as we head even into Friday afternoon, we could see those temperatures staying in the 40s. Still several days out, so the models not in quite synchronicity on the intensity of that cold. So we could be 40s or 50s in the afternoon. That's something we're keeping a very close eye on for you, but we are alerting it to you well in advance because we definitely want you to be prepared for that. First alert satellite and radar is quiet. This is how it's going to stay for the next couple of days because of that high pressure in place. But it might be a little bit of a shock when you step outside. We're at 49 degrees in Grand Prairie right now, 44 in Mesquite, 46 in Greenville. Beautiful day on the way by lunchtime. We're sitting in the mid 60s, 68 around 1 o'clock, and then we are going to see those highs near 70. But tonight we're going to have temperatures back down into the 40s. Then for your Friday, highs will be very similar to today topping out in the lower 70s and that first alert seven day forecast is showing the rain moving in on Monday Wednesday. That's when that colder air is in place and that's why we have that weather alert just because it's been quite some time since we've had temperatures that only top out in the 50s. Yeah.